human being. And here is the story, the story about man, which came from nowhere and became a hero. I saw this guy come from the gutter. He's like the Mike Tyson of body, but he came from a boy's home, broken family, and had a dime in his pocket. He didn't have the money. This was a man who was living on a limited budget. And here he was now, one of the top bodybuilders in the world. 24 hours a day, seven days a week, you know, he's focusing on this win. He's worked very hard with very little uh, resources. He, he doesn't have a cush lifestyle. He doesn't drive around in a nice Mercedes Benz. This guy is literally the Rocky of bodybuilding. If it snowed outside, if it was raining, we still gotta go to the gym. I cut school, I'm going to the gym. I cut school, I'm gonna go to sleep. If I meet the end of the world tonight, I'm in the place that I wanna be, right here in the gym. Ladies and gentlemen, the predator dies free. Every time you spend time with Kai Green, you feel like you're a better person. You know, I encourage you to be of good courage, be of good faith, be of good confidence. Step forward and you can achieve your dream. Uh, remember, the choices are yours. You can make anything be what you want it to be. You think it and it happens. You think it and it happens. Here he is as a man who grew up with no parents, went from foster home to foster home, and he was kind of happy in a sense to be doing what he loved the most. Because I believe this to be the most important pursuit of my life. Is that a dream? Yes. Can it be done? I believe so. I was at the press conference, and when you came out, man, the fans went crazy for you. I mean, I'm a huge fan of Kai Green. You know, he's been my favorite bodybuilder. Kai Green has been a big, big inspiration to me. I really started to believe the things that Kai believed, and it, it helped me tremendously. Kai Green is the reason that the trend. Kai Green, you're an example of how bodybuilders should look like. I was rooting for Kai, man, because he has, like, the most motivation. Kai, you deserve to be Mr. Rowling. I wanted to think artistically about human body and how how to express feelings. I can feel that. I can feel it with my fingertips. I can feel it inside of my body. I can feel that. Phil Heath! He can do it, you know, why not me? I honestly think, in my opinion, that Ty Green should have won.